Hi friends, welcome to the channel of Learning by Doing. Today I'm gonna teach you another two tags that is the anchor tag and also the cell padding tags of it. Uh, so now I'm going to open my notepad here. It was already having some basic tags in it. So I'm gonna teach you today the anchor tag. Anchor tag is nothing but uh, the tag which gonna link your. Uh, uh, I mean, we are giving some link to link address to. Uh, some part of our text like uh, i'll show you the anchor tag is uh, will be represented using the a's a within the angular braces and in this we are going to give a reference link as um, i'm going to give here as https uh, google just google.com not anything more www dot google dot co dot in this is my link reference to my anchor tag what I'm gonna give so um, I'm uh, giving the text as Google for this when I click this Google uh, text there it will automatically links to the address of uh, google.co.in and the anchor tag will be end by using the closing tag of slash a as usual and uh, now i'm gonna tell you another type of tag is called the uh, table tags that uh, that was the main tag of, uh, which we which, uh, mostly we learn in our HTMLs because uh, we want to display some content in the table how we're going to display this uh, we are having a table tag in this that is uh, going to be represented as table itself as usual and the table tag is going to be end by slash table in between this we are having the two types of tags called the tr tag and the th tag what is meant by the tr tag and what is meant by the th tag is nothing but tr tag is the table row and the th tag is the table heading what is the heading of your tag and in which row you want to insert these headings and in which row you want to insert any items or in the table so i'm gonna insert my row now tr tag by inserting the tr tag and um, and tr tag is also having um, the closed tr tag and in between this tr tag i'm gonna insert the table heading as um just say name okay name and slash th and i'm gonna copy this uh, because uh, no need of uh, writing this again um okay um i'll paste it here because we are having the two headings to our table that is just as usual name and age okay okay age uh, in the first row of my table I need the headings as the name and the age and I'm gonna insert another row to my table that is as uh, I again started the TR tag and I will end the TR tag by slash TR and in between this I'm writing the table data right it is not the heading so uh, what uh, what is table heading and what is table data in the sense in that the table uh, heading will look in some bold letters and the table data will be written in the so uh, normal font as usual so table data i'm gonna give the data as um, um manwith name of him name uh name as manwith and it was the table data and i'm gonna give the another tag called um, table data with um a is right have one year so i'm gonna give uh, number zero one and uh, the table data for the second uh, row is also completed uh, we'll see how it's gonna look um i'll save it and uh, we're gonna run it again mm, yes okay I'm gonna open with this Google Chrome again and how it's gonna look we'll see it mm. it's taking a long time why so okay uh, Google that uh, that I was given the link address for this Google right where I'll click it what's gonna show you'll see the address of how what we are given the address for this is uh, Google co dot in right uh, it will go for that address see guys uh, we are here to in the www dot google co dot in so uh, this is nothing but the use of an anchor tag and um, what other we seen here is um, the table tag right 
table tag uh, this is what the heading and this is what the uh, heading in the first row and this is what the content i mean the data in the table man with 0 1 years but it doesn't display it in the form of table but uh, it was shown as uh, in the name under the name heading we are having the man with as uh, the name and under the age heading we are having the 0 1 years as the heading but uh, how to look the table uh, uh, how to look uh, the format just as table is we're gonna use the cell padding one of the attribute in the table tag right um, okay um, I'm gonna insert uh, the cell padding attribute in this is equal to 20 okay I'll give 20 um, and uh, let me tell you there is an another uh, attribute in this also we can use our border as we want to give border to our table as um, and it only I'll put two uh, two borders like this uh, control yes as usual and I'm gonna see how it gonna look in the chrome okay mm. See, uh, let me refresh it. See, guys, um, here we have uh, the cell. If when we insert the cell padding as an attribute, we are we are gonna see this in the form of a table, and each and every row and the call, uh, each and every row in that table was uh, done with some uh, cells, internal cells. It is nothing but a cell padding technique. And uh, this is all about the acronym tag and also the, uh, sorry, not acronym. It is an anchor tag and also the cell padding tag and table tags in it. Thanks for watching this video. If you like my video, uh, subscribe to my channel.